What is going on, my YouTube friends, my Patreon friends? What is going on, man? This is how awkward I'm being today. This is how awkward I'm being today. Let's jump into this. Ariana Grande, one last time, live from One Love Manchester. Man, this is just like gotta be one of those events that's just like, the energy in the room must have just been incredible. I, I, I'm just presuming, I'm just presuming. Like, watching this crowd from the bits and pieces I've seen from other like One Love performances, I don't, like, I don't know enough about it to say if there were different years or, I think it was a couple years they did this, but anyway, anyway, anyway. I appreciate this, this was compliments of my friend Mayor B from the Patreon and I appreciate this as always. I love Ariana Grande. I've said this to probably six singers over the last few weeks, like I listen to, I've been, fortunate enough to be handed like a few records a few demos and stuff before they go out and i've literally told people like you should go listen to some ariana grande like go listen to what she's up to for her vocals go back and shoot a few things and then i think it's good like that's honestly been my like prescription for the last little while so i appreciate this um a lot of the ariana grande stuff gets blocked on youtube so i am playing the transparency game i hope you all have seen this one before i can see it it's clean as day bright as day whatever on my side so it's all good uh Excuse me, my friends. Let's get into this. I've talked enough. Let's uh, let's watch this. Oh come on! What am I doing here? Thank you so so much. That's what I'm talking about, man. Like I couldn't imagine how she felt. I couldn't imagine how she felt. Thank you so so much to these incredible artists for coming here to sing and be loving today and share their gifts with me so much. Thank you so, so much, everybody. And thank you, man, I love you so much. Thank you. Do we have one more, come on. Will you help us with this one, please? <laughs> Is she gonna perform with them all up there? Oh man, my voice is getting shaky already. Yep. for getting through this man like so there's like there's a couple of things I don't really know how to explain unless it's happened to you like so when I sing if I'm having like an emotional moment or I'm singing a song that's just like hitting me in a certain way and if it's like anything in my falsetto I just like start shedding tears like it's not like crying it's just like it's almost like a like a sinus pressure thing like they just come out and it's 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 a part of like the emotional like just in the moment like feeling things right so like me hearing her start to sing higher and higher I'm just waiting for her to just like to start crying like literally sobbing like i'm about to <laughs> like i just shout it to her man like what a pro what a pro you can hurt hear that she's emotional but like what a pro man she's brave enough to like be doing runs and stuff and it sounds like she's singing a lot louder than i've seen her sing because it's like it's almost an almost anthemic in this like where it's this movement that she's capturing right like it's just it's so cool <laughs> It jump sounds amazing. And I know what I know what I know she gives you everything. Well, I couldn't give it to you. And I know what I know what I know that you got everything. But I got nothing here without you, baby.
like doing those runs and stuff i'm gonna back it up so we can go do the build up to this doing those runs and stuff man must be so easy for her now it just must be so casual because like as if she could sing like that when she's like on the verge of, of crying at her event right like come on man <laughs> Drummer is amazing, eh? Great cadence on the way out, eh? And let you go. Come on, man, that was beautiful. Come on, man. Oh. My friends, it hurts. My heart. <laughs> I thought it was just beautiful. Just beautiful, like the emotion captured and the performance and like just the fact that she's willing to be emotional. Like how could you not be? How could you not be under the circumstances? I really don't want to get into it because I won't be able to get through it. <laughs> but yeah, it's neat that she had everyone on stage, man. That's really cool. Band was going off. I'm not gonna get into that. Oh, here, here's a good spot. I was gonna talk about how they had like their monitors set up. So these are probably just like fail safes because it's like a festival setup. And then there's also this. This is, so this is the front of a speaker screen, I believe. It might not be. They might have monitor, and then this could be a front fill. I think these are front fills. This is just for like the people in the front, right? Like right in the front of the crowd. Because like when you have your big, uh, your hanging PA stacks, your line arrays. Like they miss the first six rows, right? So you have to have stuff like this so you can get the vocals up. And But my friends, I'm just trying to steer myself out of this emotional nosedive. So <laughs> till the next one, my friends. We'll see you soon.